morning! Greetings, salutations, you guys. It's Hayden here. Welcome to another episode of the vlog. Um, I think I told you guys yesterday that I was gonna cut my hair. I just cut it yesterday night, so haircut it looks pretty much the same. Uh, I have the kids with me. They're running around the fountain right here before we go into the car because we are going to go to the grocery store. They're really excited about it. We're going on a little trip today because they don't have school. And yeah, anyway. All right, let's go, boys. All right, you can sit next to Snorlax. It's Come on. Chest tape. All right, we are in the car. Everyone say hi. Hi. Say hello, Katie Kins. Hello. Zachary, Elizo. Are you gonna say hi? Hi. Say hi. Where are we going? We're gonna go to go to the store, I think. Yep. And what are you guys gonna get? Uh, I don't know. I don't know, man. No. You what? You guys just ate lunch. No, we're gonna we're gonna buy we have to buy veggies. We're gonna buy some turkey and we're gonna buy some chicken. And I'll let you guys each pick one thing. Okay. Do you know what you're gonna pick? I have no idea what to pick. I think I know what Zach and Eliza are gonna pick. Cheetos. Zach's gonna get Cheetos. Eliza's gonna get Ruffles. Kate's oh. gonna get vinegar I'm chips. Get oh, what are you gonna get, Eliza? I don't know. Oh, okay. I don't know yet. All right, we'll see when we get there. What store are we going to? Let's see you guys at the, at the store. All right, you guys, we are at the store now. We're gonna get some veggies first. So we're gonna go to the produce aisle. All right, we got all of our various lettuces. We got our tomatoes and cabbage. All right, now we're gonna go over to the meat aisle and get some turkey. And Kate is choosing chocolate chip cookies as his treat for today's trip. All right, All right we got ground turkey. We got our turkey breast. This is where I know these kids want to go, is the chip aisle. Ooh, hold on, let me look at these. Salt and vinegar Pringles? That's over here, salt and vinegar. You want this one? Oh, okay. Now those two are heading over there to look for the other chips that Zach wants. And I'm not eating any chips, because those are high in carbs. <laughs> Is that what you want? Ooh, what is that? Show me. Is that the super spicy one? Here's the probably the unhealthiest snack. Wow. All right, we got some helpers. You gotta scan it and then put it on the side. $12.99. Move it over. There you go. $2.99. Thank you. Next. $1.00. $14.99 Ooh, it's on sale. Alright, this one. $4.99 Now you, excuse, you gotta hold it like this. Okay. So I can scan it through the plastic. Okay. Everybody get on each side. Mm -hmm. Or open the plastic. So you can scan it. Okay, try it again. There you go. Please replace the item removed from the bagging area. Please continue scanning. Here you go. Just put it on there. And you have to enter the quick look up. So look up my name and type in lettuce. L. No, no, no. Touch the item to purchase. Touch the item to purchase. And you got a lettuce. I think it's this ice cream. No, oh no, it's this one. Enter your iceberg lettuce quantity and one. Place your iceberg okay. lettuce in the bag. One forty-nine, two ninety-nine. Plus one. And now we're headed out. <laughs> right, we just got inside the car. Everyone show your snacks. So what did you pick, kid? Kid got chocolate chip cookies, his fave. And then what did you get, Elizo? Pringles. And Zachary Taylor Thomas, the spiciest Cheetos. Yes, spicy. Now who's ready for McDonald's? Me. What are you guys gonna get? Uh, I already know what to get, you guys. I, I, I think I think I know what to get. I think it's probably gonna be the one. 
Chicken nuggets, chicken nuggets, chicken nuggets, chicken nuggets, fries. Okay. So you don't need a hamburger. Alright, you guys got home. We're getting the groceries in. We already got all the McDonald's inside for the or for the boys, so. I always forget that we still have this dog here. <laughs> Alright, you guys, for dinner, mom made turkey lettuce cups. So we have like the bib lettuce right here, our butter lettuce. And then we're essentially just going to put some of this in there and then eat it. So it's nice, healthy, and delicious. And it's really fun. Hey guys, it is now the next day. Eliza's here. Say hi, Eliza. Hi. What are you doing? Eating. You're eating? There's no food over there. Are you excited to go swimming today? Yes. Huh? Of guys, mom made delicious omelets. I'm so excited and we're gonna have some coffee too. Hello, Zachary Banks. Hello. What do you have to tell everyone today? Subscribe. What else? And like. And? Oh, Wing. Liza's dropping stuff upstairs. Let's go see what he's doing. Ring the notification bell. Okay guys, let's do a quick update for what we've been doing. So mom collected these persimmons from our garden. Uh, we cleaned and washed them and put them in here, had a little photo shoot and they look really delicious. Now they're ready to eat, but we're probably gonna put most of these inside the fridge. And then over here, before mom uses them all, we also collected some of our lemons from the front of the house. Because people are Before them. people steal all of them, because people have been stealing our lemons. Like we have some fruit trees in the front and people are literally stealing them before our eyes. So we grabbed some of our lemons, which are these. Look at this beautiful uh, Kate Spade for Lennox bowl that I got. It's navy and a white polka dots. It's really cute. And mom is making tonight's dinner. She's marinating it. Uh, I, these are the chicken breasts that I bought yesterday with the kids. Uh, just lemon, lots of garlic, salt, pepper, and red pepper flakes. Right? Yes. That's everything. And a little bit of oil. And I'm going to put some olive oil. Yeah, and she's going to put some olive oil in there too. So that's what's there right now in the sink. Mm. And... We're going to grill this up later. Today it's a warm, warm day. It is like going to be in the 90s today, which is crazy. So, But today is Friday. Everyone's home because the kids don't have work, school. Dad's back already from work. And I'm trying to clean up the house. I just got inside the car and it is warm. It's 86 degrees. It was a lot warmer earlier on. It was like... 90 I think like 93 degrees and it's finally like kind of cooled down a little but like the car is still hot because it's like you know it chops in all of that heat and stuff anyway I just uh, got inside the car I'm gonna head over to the post office really quick because it's like four o'clock and I just want to drop off a couple things before the weekend some of my hair is just like bugging me um, before the weekend all orders should be shipped out i think and thank you for everyone that shopped yesterday during that like depop free shipping sale i know i did a really bad job like announcing it and i didn't really do anything or upload anything into the shop um but you guys sent me messages and we just got some um we, we um did just like free shipping on some items that were in previous um, live sales, so that was awesome. Um, I should do that next time, like if you guys, yeah, anyway. Um, but that live, that sale was just for yesterday, which was 11-11, and then I think there might be another sale on Depop, um, like Black Friday weekend or something like that. I think they're gonna do something about like, um, like, uh, Cyber Monday, Shop Small Saturday or, something like that so hopefully i don't know hopefully i find out about it and i'll let you guys know but i'm definitely gonna have some sort of black friday shopping event i just don't know if it's going to be that weekend or that monday or like the week before i don't know exactly how i'm gonna do it but let me know what you guys think down below like when i should actually have the sale and when you guys have time uh but anyway we're gonna go to the 
post office, then we're gonna go to Veterans Thrift, and then we're gonna head over to the grocery store really quick because I want cucumbers uh, for like snack and stuff. Cucumbers are so are, like super healthy and they don't have like a lot of calories or carbs or anything. So they're like a great diet snack and I love them. And I'm gonna make some like pickled ones and I'm also going to eat some with this like spicy Korean sauce stuff that my mom makes and they're so delicious. So. See you guys in a second. All right, you guys, we just got to the Veterans Thrift. I kind of had to park a little far, but it's okay. We're gonna go inside, hopefully find some treasures. Tonight there's a live sale, so if you guys are watching this on Saturday when this video is probably gonna go up, live sales every Friday and Saturday night at 10 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, so there's gonna be one tonight. I also do giveaways every night too, so they're super duper fun, but I'll see you guys inside the store. All right, let's go in and check it out. Okay. Okay, let's check out the handbags. Tommy Hilfiger. Oh, this Dooney and Burke is still here and it's still super expensive. I just found a fake Chanel. It's kinda cute that's 40 bucks. There's this coach bag, but it's 40 bucks. What is this? Oh, Claire Vivier, 30 bucks. It's kinda cute, maybe we'll get this. Hold on to it. Urban Outfitters. I just also found this little case fade wallet. It's 20 bucks, but it's really cute. And it's in pretty good condition. Just use the cleaning on the outside. So we're thinking about that. I also found this case fade double zip satchel. But the inside is like gross and it's 40 bucks. So maybe we'll wait. All right, I'm looking through the jewelry case. Sorry if it's really loud here, the fan is a little intense, but it's nice though because it's really warm. <laughs> so it's like nice and cooling. I'm looking at the sunglasses. Those ones right there are Valentino. Those are less spec. There's some clothes. Those things are like kind of interesting. Eyeballs and vampire things. Let's take a look through the house stuff, housewares, really quick. I feel like I never take you guys through here whenever I come in. But I always do take a quick look. Oh my gosh, this llama is so stinking cute. It's from Pier 1. <laughs> Oh. Let's look at this stuff over here. Is this Dorothy? This is Dorothy from The Wizard of Oz. She's 99 cents. Star, Libra United. Is this from 1998? Is this vintage? I found these super heavy Waterford crystal glasses. Um, ooh. Looks like there's two at least. Do I see any more? These are kind of cool. They're like Christmassy. They have a little Christmas scenery. Found this Rebecca Minkoff uh, crossbody strap in the belt section, which is exciting. Wonder if I could find anything else in here. Oh my gosh, how cute are these Valentino flats? They're a size 40. They're like ballet shoes. I'm pretty sure these are authentic too. Oh my gosh, they are. They're only 30 bucks. I think I gotta get these. They're so cute. Found these Emporio Armani boots with like a peep toe. They're really cute. One of the metal aglets is missing, but the leather is 
super soft and looks to be in not horrible shape, but it's 50 bucks. So we'll see if this goes on sale. Hey right, guys, um, this is crazy, but I found these same Aquazora shoes here like a few days ago. <laughs> and I found another pair. That's good. Like It's also in good condition. My camera died, but I had to change batteries. But yeah, I found these last week. I found another pair. Like, is there is it is there really? Like now I'm like, did I not buy it? But I feel like I did. <laughs> like I'm pretty sure I bought them, right? Like I'm not crazy. They have these YSLs. Saw these last time. Um, let's see if there's any other cool shoes here today. The Valentinos are so cute and they're like flats and I feel like a lot of you guys like flats more than like heels and stuff or maybe like a cute like platform would be fun too. Um, but I'm gonna see if they fit mom because I feel like she might like them if they fit her. So we're gonna have to see if they fit mom first. Oh those other shoes that I got for her too, the Jack Rogers. One of like, they they don't fit, they're just like a little, one of them's a little too big because like, Mom has like a smaller foot and a larger foot, just like most people. <laughs> and um, yeah, it didn't work out for her. So I'll probably be putting them up in the live sale maybe tonight. If I remember, Vince Camuto. Uh, Soul Society, something Katie, Vince, I don't know what that is, I thought the logo is Vince Camuto for a second, um, Giuseppe Zanotti, look at those snake skin heels, amazing, Vince Camuto, There's some Ferragamo right over there. Those are pricey. These Brian Atwood metallic heels. See, like, I would love to buy these, but I feel like no one would buy them because I keep buying heels and then no one ever buys them because they're too high. <laughs> it's my own fault. Or I just buy shoes that are too small. And then the shoe size that everyone wants is like mom's shoe size, but they end up going to her. It's like a catch 22. Jessica Simpson. Uggs. So these Brian Atwoods are amazing. 30 bucks. All right, got some goodies. Let's go home. I'll show you guys what I got. Oh, it's also dinner time. Yay. If these fit mom, we just got home. These are Valentino flats. They look like little ballerina shoes with lace. And what size? Size 40. Let's see if they fit. They match your outfit. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. She's an off-duty ballerina right now. Off-duty ballerina. <laughs> of course they <laughs> fit. <gasps> wow, look at you, a little ballerina. My dad wears this. I haven't seen this shoes, this style of shoes in my life. Do you like it or no? Otherwise, I'll sell them. <laughs> no, it's so flat, Gucci. I can't wear it. Too flat? Okay. Mm -hmm. But they fit. Size eight and a half. All right, you guys. It's now time to pick our winner uh, for tonight's giveaway. We are giving away this beautiful Kipling wallet right here. It has a cute little monkey attached as well. And... Everyone say hi because you guys are now live in the vlog. Oh, nope. This is my list of stuff. Oh, here it is. All right. We're using our YouTube random comment picker right here. We're going to enter in the link for the video. Let us see how many comments we have. All right. Looks like we are at... Oh, 598. All right, 598 entries. We're going to pick a, th a winner in three, two, one. Boop, boop, boop.
Mama Sheila, you won. Oh my gosh, Mama Sheila. There you are, I already see you. Congratulations, Mama Sheila. Congratulations. This is like your third, is this your third win, Mama Sheila? Oh my gosh, congratulations um, on winning. Hey guys, okay, so uh, I wanted to show you guys what I ended up getting from the Veterans Thrift. So this is just like, I'm filming this like a few days later, but I ended up getting these the beautiful Valentino shoes. I showed you guys that when mom tried them on. And they do fit her, but they're like too flat for her. Mom doesn't like shoes that are too flat. She likes a little bit of elevation, so she likes to be a little taller. But these are size 40, but they fit her. She is a size eight and a half. And they fit her really, really well. So, um, and they're really in great shape. They are so pretty. The studs, the lace, they are gorgeous. And then I also ended up getting what's super crazy is I found another pair of these Aqua Zura heels. And it's crazy. These are a size 38, right? Okay. So, the other day... Did I ever film a haul for these? I don't think I did. Oh, you know what? I probably never filmed a haul. Anyway, I got another pair of these Aqua Zura shoes, which is a little nuts. So I literally have two pairs of the exact same shoe and they're the same color and size. They're both 38 and it's crazy. So I don't know what happened, but I was able to get my hands on two of these shoes. Aqua Zura shoes are actually really, really expensive. And um, the resale is actually really good too. Like these resale for a couple hundred dollars, I think like 300 or more. And what's crazy about these particular shoes like this style and color and everything was seen on like literally all the Kardashians and um Nicole Richie I think or no Gigi Hadid like it was nuts like l they literally all have photos wearing these same exact shoes which is nuts so I'm pretty stoked about it pretty cool I thought that was pretty interesting I got these two glasses um I just thought they were really pretty, but I didn't notice, like, I literally did not notice this until I was paying at the register and I put the glasses on the counter. Like, I did not notice that one was a large one and one was, like, a smaller one, like, slightly smaller. So that was really funny. I did not notice until I got them up there. But they are Waterford Crystal and they weigh a ton. These things are so heavy, but they're so pretty. I love the design on them. Um, like, look at the design. Does it show? I don't know. Like, the lighting might not show it. And I love, like, the stem of it. And then it has, like, gold rims. And these are really pretty. They're 75 cents each, which I was like, whoa, those are a great deal. So I had to get them. I got those. And then I got that, um, random, uh, Rebecca Minkoff strap. Which is great because sometimes you find those Rebecca Minkoff bags without a strap. And this I could just like dye it or something to match the bag or whatever. So I thought that was pretty cool. This was $3.98. It was in the belt section. I guess it kind of looks like a belt. So I got that. And then um, this was a pretty cool find that I was excited about because I love Claire V. And I found um, this Claire V bag. It's a Claire V double zip crossbody bag. You can remove the crossbody straps and then this just becomes a clutch and it is in this embossed lizard skin leather and it has a little Claire V medallion right there and yeah the interior is nice and clean it's um in the chambray fabric that she usually uses to line everything and this bag was $30 so that's it um, that is the end of today's video. That's our little haul. So I hope you guys had fun. If you guys enjoyed the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to say hi down below in the comments, especially if you guys are new to the channel. Welcome. So happy to have you here. Welcome to the third squad. Um, tune in tomorrow at 7 a.m. for a new video. The new vlog is going to go up at 2. And then if you didn't see this morning's 15 video, go check that out as well. And I'll see you guys all in the next one. All right. Bye, guys.